Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Jordy. If you have not seen me before, it's been quite a minute since I've posted here on YouTube um, due to life. <laughs> Today we are doing a look that was inspired by my baby Doja Cat. Um, it's from her Say So music video. I will insert a picture if I can. It's when she had the mint green. I look, it was so beautiful. She looks so good in that video. To me, it was pretty simple to go ahead and do this. I think I only used two colors. No, three. I'm lying. Three or four. Also, please go ahead and subscribe if you do like this video. Give me a thumbs up. Please share. And let's get started. Okay, guys. I just want to go ahead and let you know that editing is going to be a little bit off due to the fact that my MacBook needs to be repaired. And so I'm just doing it on my iPad at the moment. But starting off, I already have my brows filled in and we are using a base. We're using my Sony Cash Up Cream Concealer. Now going in with my Juvia's Place Zulu Palette, I'm going to go ahead and use that matte green shade and kind of just pack that into my crease. Now I'm not going to blend it out as much as hers was because I do want it to be a bit more dramatic. Going back in with that Sony Cash Up Concealer, I'm just going to go ahead and cut my crease. Now I'm not winging this out, I'm just going to go ahead and cut out the eyelid space and then I'm going to pack a glittery mint green shade onto the lid and that is the Macaron shade from the Juvia's Place Deuce Palette. Not even going to lie to y'all, <laughs> um, I probably would not recommend using this concealer as a base when it comes to cut creases because after a few hours it did kind of begin to clump up a little bit in the crease area. Um, if anybody has an actual, I guess like eyeshadow base that's really, really good that won't end up making your eyeshadow crease like that, please recommend it down below for me. <laughs> For liner, I'm using my RK by Kiss Liquid Genius Black Liquid Liner, and now we're going to go ahead and move along to the face. So I'm priming my skin with my Makeup Revolution Star Primer, the water gel one, and I'm just going to go ahead and massage that into my skin. This is my, I believe, third time trying this foundation, and I really like it, but I do believe that I can either mix a shade in or go a shade, I guess a shade more neutral. Um, this is my Juvia's Place I Am Magic Matte Foundation in the shade number 420 Havana. So I did layer my concealers. Um, I used my Clinique Beyond Perfecting Foundation and Concealer and I used that in the shade 23 Ginger. I also went ahead and topped that off with my Revlon Candy Concealer in the shade number 050 or medium deep. Honestly, I really could have went a shade lighter with uh, my concealer, but I mean, you know, your girl happy with how it turned out. <laughs> I actually had to go ahead and re-up on this because I ran out a while ago, but this is the Cody Airspun Translucent Powder, and if you have not tried this yet, guys, this is one of my favorites. The only thing you may not like about it, if you haven't tried it, is the fact that it does have a strong odor. So for contour, I'm using my RK by Kiss 3D Contour Artist Powder Kit, and this is in the shade Medium Dark. Going back into my Juvia's Place Deuce Palette, I'm going to go ahead and use that shade Crepes as my blush because I didn't have one on hand. I really feel like I haven't heard about this palette or seen anyone use it in so long, but this is one of my favorites. It's the Anastasia Beverly Hills Moonshot Palette and I'm using the two shades Blue Ice and Lucky Clover to put in my inner corner. For my bottom lash line, I went ahead and used the same matte green shade that I put in my crease and off camera I went ahead and put some light liner into my waterline. That is the NYX Wonder Pencil in the shade Light. Now this is an old mascara but it's, I've never used it before but this probably will be one of my new favorites. It's the Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara. Now the lashes that I just popped on, those are from I Envy by Kiss. It's their Extreme, Extreme 3D Collection Lashes in KPEI number 33. 
Y'all, I went on a Fenty Beauty shopping spree so long ago and I still haven't used all the products that I bought. But this is her Kilowatt Highlighter in Chills. It's a pretty icy blue shade. It is so beautiful. Now finally for lips, I'm using three different lip products. <laughs> so first I'm using my Academy of Color Brown Liquid Lipstick just for the outline of my lips. I'm not going to go ahead and bring it in the corners or anything, I'm just going to leave it just like that. Now for the center I'm using my Fenty Beauty Unbutton Liquid Lipstick and I didn't get this part on camera but I used my Rimmel London Take a Chill Pill Satin Liquid Lipstick just to top everything off. To set everything in place I just used my Mario Badescu Lavender Facial Spray and you are finally finished. Here's a finished look guys. I really hope that you enjoyed this video. Once again, please give me a thumbs up, leave a comment, go ahead and subscribe, please share, and I'll see you guys in the next one.